The confusion over masking up continues. The Department of Justice now plans to appeal a Florida judge's decision that overturned the travel mask mandate. It comes as cities and schools across the country reinstate their own mask mandates, with the U.S. seeing a rise in cases. ABC's Rena Roy has the latest. The battle over masks being taken to court once again with the Justice Department fighting back at the request of the CDC. The DOJ vowing to appeal after a Florida federal judge overturned the travel mask mandate earlier this week. Millions of travelers are going maskless after the judge's decision, but many health experts are backing the CDC, which says an order requiring masking in the indoor transportation corridor remains necessary for the public's health. This change in policy sets a really challenging precedent. A single judge overturning a mandate driven by public health professional means that we're unnecessarily putting many people at risk. The country seeing a rise in new daily cases, subvariants of BA2 likely to blame. The COVID cases to me are rising. I gave immunizations in the pharmacy, so I do know how important it is to wear the mask. This school in Los Angeles reinstating its face covering requirement after dozens contracted the virus. Honestly, I wasn't that surprised because, you know, spring break was Coachella. Everyone's going on vacation. Nearly 100 students at San Mateo High School in California's Bay Area also testing positive after prom. You have to just weigh, are you willing to sacrifice what will happen if you do get COVID and you have to quarantine? versus is it worth it to just go out and have a good time. New York City on the cusp of raising its COVID risk level to yellow or medium with new cases going up. The governor keeping the state's indoor mask mandate in place. With the uptick in new cases, the Department of Homeland Security is extending vaccination requirements for non-citizens traveling into the U.S.